I took time to interview and find out some information about vegetable gardens. Um, just like we have learned in the sessions that we have been having, that we need to go out and speak to people and find out more information. Uh, the first one is a video on the community garden in Riaboth, um called Hope. Uh, you have to excuse my camera work. It's actually my little brother. It's a little bit shaky. As you can see, the lady was kind enough to show me around. Um, I learned a lot of things from her. She showed me certain things and also things that you need to use, different tools and so forth. Um, I noted down all the things and we actually had a, a very great time. And it's not <laughs> that often that you find people that are willing to share information, but um, I really appreciate the fact that she took time to speak with me, show me around. I was able to see things practically. The second one is just a small vegetable garden at the back of the house where I'm currently staying in Vantuk. It was set up by one of my housemates. And uh, yeah, I just wanted to find out more information. And through that, I understood when we were taught, uh, told to go out and actually find out more information about our projects. I actually learned some things from him while he was putting this up um, and these are some of the things that I want to use when I put up the, the garden in Riaboth. So we're just going to find out some of the information on how easy it was for him to put this up and you know what you need and what can be a little bit, uh, uh, what cannot work out while you are putting this up and so forth. So yeah. First when I started we were cleaning up here, just mm -hmm. cleaning, cleaning. Yeah. And when I see the soil was very nice yeah. to plant a garden. Mm -hmm. And when I, I, I think, when I came, we like, uh, we dig, we dig, and we level the soil. Mm -hmm. And I go to shop, right, and I buy, I bought um, so the seed of the carrot and the seed of the onions. Oh. And we just plant to water it first, and we level the soil, we water, we level until the soil gets moist. And from there now, we, um, we, 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 we seed. Every day I have to make sure I water it. Yeah. So it took around six, one month and a couple of weeks for the seeds to come out, for the plants to come out. So I almost gave up because they were not coming out and then <laughs> it was just too much soil, I mean, uh, too much grasses, too much grasses. So yeah. I almost gave up, but I always water and taking care of the garden. It's mm. very, very, it's not easy to take care of the garden, too much attention on that. Mm. So when they come out, they were a lot and then 
from there i have to transparent them i have to separate them see how is it going but yeah. if you if you feel like you wanted a garden and and then you always are easily to give up you mm. won't make it because yeah. it's not easy especially when they are coming out from the soil it oh, takes okay. months and days for it to come out Okay. And also watering and then watering every day and the, the thing is not putting on the um the fruits so it's difficult for that okay so um gardening and so forth um what i want to say is just that um let's not let's stop depending from shops every time oh. there are things we can do being yeah. on board do something go plan something yeah. always it's always nice when you have a garden like this yeah yeah when you want to eat nice things you come here, you take some pellets, there are some plants, then you yeah. put it in the pot. Do now, if you depend yeah. from the shops, every day you buy, yeah. so it won't help. Okay, let's say somebody wants to, to, to make a living out of this in terms of, uh, um, in, in terms of uh, planting some, some vegetables and also selling them at the same time. Do you think yeah. they can benefit out of it as well? They can benefit. Okay. Yeah, because also, if you if you look at the carrot mm. itself, it have that... Uh, they, they, they have the carrots and the leaves. Yeah. So from the leaves you can make a parsley. If they, uh, you can take uh, the carrots out and you sell it out, and the leaves you dry them, you make a parsley. Oh, okay. Yeah, just to, to decorate the rice or whatever food. Wow, really? Yes. Yeah. Okay, I didn't even know some of these things, but I'm learning <laughs> as well. Yeah. But yeah.